Yo, 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 it's your boy Jack Move. I got I gotta ask y'all a question, man, because I feel like I feel like this is wasteful. I feel like Walmart on bullshit, okay? So I found out the other day one of my favorite movies of all time, a movie I've been waiting for ever since 4K Blu-rays have been a thing. What the heck? Cookie, what you doing? Anyway, shout out to Cookie. Um, ever since 4 4K Blu-rays been a thing, uh, I've been wanting a Nightmare on Am Street, the original joint from 19, what is it, 1987? I don't even know what year the fucking movie came out. I think it was like 84, 87, one of them. Anyway, I've been wanting this shit on 4K Blu-ray. Long story short, it's finally got announced. It was it was a pre-order on Best Buy. Doc, I mean Best Buy. It was a pre-order on Walmart.com. That was the only place it was available. I had to pre-order as soon as I seen it. Now, the pre-order... The movie is $34.99. Now, I find out on Walmart.com, if you spend at least $35 and above, you get free shipping, right? But it's $34.99. I wanted free shipping, and I wasn't paying that for that bum-ass membership. So, I'm like, all right, cool. I ain't feel like doing no free trial. I ain't doing none of that shit. I'm not signing up for no free trial. I'm not... I, Either make the movie a penny more or let me get the fucking free shipping. I'm not paying an extra seven dollars for no reason. So I was like, fuck it. Let me find something that's cheap. So I add a back, I add a thing of candy. It's like a dollar fifty. But guess what? The dollar fifty candy coming from somebody else, it got seven dollars shipping on the dollar candy still. It would have still been cheaper than just getting the movie with the shit. I'm like, I'm not doing none of that. So I'm searching on the website. I add some headphones. If I get the headphones, I gotta come pick them up. Mind you, this movie don't even got a fucking release date yet. I'm not doing none of that. At least ship the headphones with the movie whenever it come out. Fuck it, right? So, I'm searching. Mad shit. So, this is what I had to do. I had to find some candy that they did not have in stock, meaning they had to ship it. Also, it had to have free shipping, and that was very difficult to do. Most of the candy that they didn't have in stock, that they had... Any type of shit, you had to spend mad money. Anyway, long story short, I finally found something I could buy that could get me free shipping. Now, this is what's crazy, right? I had to pay the whole amount for the movie and this already. I don't know when the movie's coming out. I don't know if this motherfucker ever coming out. I had to get them that 45, whatever the fuck. But I don't know how much it was, bro. I don't know what I got to open this, bro. A knife. Let me see. Look what I had to do, bro. Look what I had to do, bro. Now, on top of that, right, do y'all know FedEx had to deliver this, bro? FedEx had to deliver this. So, they spent money to put this in a box, all because I wanted to get free shipping. Look at this, bro. Look what I had to order, bro. Look what I had to order, bro. I had to order this, bro. You mean to tell me? Now, they had to use packaging material. Get it, motherfucker, to FedEx. All the gas it took to bring it to the crib. Instead of just giving me fucking free shipping, bro. All this over a fucking penny. Which one is more wasteful, people? Which one is more wasteful? And I'm petty. I do this shit. I would have just waited to the movie. Put that motherfucker in the box when the movie come out. That wasn't even an option. Whenever the fucking movie releases, put this fucking bum-ass candy in the fucking box with the movie. This... Which one is more wasteful? Giving me free shipping or having to pay to ship this bullshit off? They had to get us to FedEx, drive it here, all that fucking fuel they wasted, packing some... Come on, bruh. Walmart, you on bullshit.